And, 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 and let me just say this. Getting ready for a trip is expensive. You looking like the 90s near long, a product of your mom. The girl in high school that every guy was sleeping on. I love how you designed, arm and shape eyes, all the lee in the face, but you shot it with the vibe. Girl, you look how limited. So you guys will be coming with me to get my hair done, brows done, nails done, toes. I got my lashes done last week. I don't want to have to deal with like a broken nail or anything, but I think that's the vibe I'm going for. I need like some type of customer appreciation or something. I got you one some once I'm like officially running the place. Kathy, when you had your own shoes, she ain't getting no customer appreciation. I did not see you that often. <laughs> Kathy, yes, you did. I was coming. Okay, I wouldn't come in as often as I was coming here. Because you was a little far. I was. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I really thought I was meeting everybody halfway, being there. You, you but, were like, not. thinking it over, um, not really. <laughs> you was not, honey. <laughs> Thank you. 
just see me breaking a nail in Cancun like no I'm not feeling it oh my god why I still got this mask on I was wondering why I'm so hot <laughs> but yes y'all so nails toes brows done y'all I'm really trying to let my brows grow out because they got so thin but um yeah nails time nails toes brows done now I'm on the way home y'all okay guys so it is much later and i am packing madison's bag because she is spending the next few days with her granny while we are on vacation so i'm putting outfits together for her and i was gonna start packing my bag tonight but honestly y'all i'm so tired so i'm pushing through to do this and still have to do her hair <laughs> so yeah I am very tired. Mama is really tired. But we're going to get this done. We're going to do her hair tonight. And then we're going to lay it on down. Because I still have to go to work in the morning. So yeah. One more day. Until vacation starts. Hey girl. Hey. So it is Thursday night. As you guys know we do. Leave for Cancun tomorrow. Our flight is at 8 a.m. So, I'm about to start packing. And y'all, I apologize if the lighting is not the best um, in my room. I'm really not fond of this lighting. But um, let me grab some scissors so I can put this um, bag tag off from the last time. Alright, y'all. So... I am getting ready to pack. It is like 8 p.m. It's 8.20 p.m. And I'm exhausted. <laughs> I feel like I've been saying I'm tired this whole vlog because, y'all, I really am. I was supposed to have a whole day of me getting everything together. But y'all know I've been going to work every day. Uh, well, maybe y'all don't know. So, I've been going to work every day because I was supposed to have Tuesday off to get everything done. My hair, nails, everything. Brows, everything. But I ended up hurting my foot on Sunday to the point where I couldn't even put pressure on it, sand on it, or anything come Monday. So, I had to call in because I'm like, I don't want to go to work and mess my foot up even more like what if it's spraying i need to try to stay off of it i sit down because who was getting on that flight on friday was me so stay home on monday so therefore i was like i don't want to take another day off on tuesday so ended up having to go to work leave get my head down. like it was just a mess so i've been having to that's why i've been having to space everything out over the past couple of days to get everything done in preparation for this trip but we have made it y'all trip is tomorrow morning so let's start packing um y'all i still have yeah. i still have stuff in here from um my last trip to Tulum. So let's start packing. So can y'all see me? Okay. So the way I like to pack my stuff is oh look some of my jewelry was still in here. So I'm gonna just keep this in here. 
Okay, y'all. So, the way I like to pack my stuff is based on the itinerary. So, I know this night I'm wearing this. This night I'm wearing that. So, y'all, when I tell you, <laughs> I, I hate to unpack. Anyway, okay. So, the first night when we get down there. She wants to go out to a club in downtown Cancun. So, I was thinking this poster girl dress. Orange. So, I was thinking this poster girl dress. So, I'm going to fold this up. With. Oh, yeah. Y'all, let me show y'all my new shoes I got. So, that poster girl dress. And... I got some new shoes. Sorry, y'all. It's already been open. I already tried them on and everything. But this is from Sammy. Oh, hold on, y'all. My food is here. Just like a two-piece set. So, the shirt and then this is the skirt. I can't really show y'all. But um, you scrunch it up like this here. So you can wear it either long or short. So, and I was going to tie the shirt up, of course. Or, I don't know, I'm going to see the vibe. Or I could tuck it in, but I'm probably going to tie it up. And... I'm probably gonna do this for Saturday night when we go to dinner. And of course, y'all will be seeing the outfits in the vlog. Sorry if y'all can't see me. Y'all will be seeing the outfits in the vlog. I don't know if I should do a whole separate what I wore on vacation type video. Because I really wanna do that kind of video. So I might do that. To like what I want on vacation. That way I can really like take time and tag everything. If everything is still available. Okay, so that. Um, I can do that for the second night. And then. And honestly, this set is a medium. I could have really sized down and got a small. Because it has a lot of extra room. But we'll make it work. And another option for a Saturday night, because um, I think she's doing dinner at Taboo. Did I say that before? No, I don't think so. But I think she's doing dinner at Taboo. So that's like a beach club. We went there in Tulum, but I think they have another location in Cancun. So she wants to do dinner there because we're going to a boat party on Saturday. So, of course, we know we're wearing swimsuits there. But then after the boat party, she wants to do dinner at Taboo. So, this could be an option. This um, green-ish set, olive set. Or this set. Um, and I think I got this set. So, it's just a button-up. Um, print leopard print pink floral kind of set and I think I got this from Touche Dolls Touch Dolls I got this like probably like a few months ago um, so I'm not sure if this is still in stock but I'm bringing this because I don't know which one I would want to do on Saturday um, and for my olive set, I'm going to bring my white, um, strap up heels to go with that. I'm going to put that over here with the shoes. Because, you guys, should I do my bags and accessories later? No, because I need to just put everything, pack everything because I'm hungry. Y'all, I'm going to wear the olive set with my new baby that I got. Oh my gosh. 
you guys isn't she gorge uh, this is my new baby i'm gonna be bringing her on the trip with me um i'm a little nervous to pack her in my check bag just because i've been hearing horror stories about people's luggage getting lost lord please no but um i don't know she might be coming in my carry-on because girl but yes we're gonna do her we're gonna pack her up Outfit. We're staying down there three nights. So, um, yeah, we're staying down there three nights. But, you know, in normal girl fashion, we always have to overpack. Okay, you guys, so I am back. I just finished my food. I had some boiled shrimp from this seafood spot and it was so good. I really needed to eat. But y'all, can I tell y'all why I'm, why I'm mad? So, I had this whole pink look in mind that I was gonna do um, because I ordered some new sunglasses. Y'all, let me show y'all. I ordered some new sunglasses. Oh yeah, let me put those in my suitcase while I'm thinking about it. Okay. So, let me go back in the living room. I ordered new glasses and they are so cute. Ooh, see. They are so cute and girly. So I put together this whole pink look in my head. If I could ever get them out the box to show you guys. Okay. So they are from Cartier. Y'all, look how cute these glasses are. Are we seeing this? Yeah. Let me try them on for y'all. Don't mind these clothes sitting on the couch. Calvin, Calvin was packing his suitcase in the living room. So he had, literally has clothes everywhere, but yeah, can we get into, can we get into these? So yeah, I had a whole pink look that I was gonna do with these glasses, right? So I ordered a pink bikini you know a very non-cheap pink bikini and I must not have been paying attention on the site or I don't know if they it wasn't in stock and they just still had it on the website I don't know y'all but come to find out the bikini was back ordered so you know while I'm sitting here waiting on the bikini I get an email probably last week and said and mind you, I ordered this end of February. End of February. I get an a email last week that my item is back ordered. So it's not even going to ship until like, is it like the 23rd, 24th or something, or something crazy like that. So. I'm like, okay. I also placed the order with Shein. Shein, Shein. I knew that I placed that order. So I was like, okay, I 
in that order i put another pink swimsuit a swim look in that order so you know it's all right i could just do that look and finesse it with you know my glasses it'll still come out cute you know whatever whatever y'all so like a couple of days ago my package said deliver ups i have signed up for notifications from all shipping companies to let me know basically when they have delivered my packages so i received a notification from ups that said my package was delivered at 11 25. so this was tuesday this was tuesday i get home at 2 30. my package said find me my package said find me it was not on my porch y'all this is the second time this is the second time like i'm really about to go around and start knocking on doors because i'm trying to figure out who is stealing packages off people's porch y'all we have legit been staying over here for probably more than two years now never happened never i have had all kind of stuff delivered to this front door furniture like bags shoes like all kind of stuff now granted some stuff you know depending on the price point it did need a signature or they would not be left on the porch but regardless of the fact i have never had an issue with that now it's like stuff is disappearing off my porch and this was a pretty large she in order like you know she and stuff be so cheap you just start adding the car adding the car and all of a sudden you up to 150 200 dollars easy because you just you're not even paying attention you're like oh nine dollars ten dollars you just add stuff in the cart so this was a pretty large order but in that order i was like oh yeah i did put like a little pink swimsuit look so i can do that with my glasses y'all i don't even have that package like it is gone so luckily with Shein, they are really good about refunding you you know they are really good about refunding you or they offer to reship the package so i just had them refund me because i really even though i really wanted my stuff like i wanted my items like i had some workout tights in there i had some little cute flip-flops in there like i just wanted my items but i knew that the majority of the stuff i was i ordered was to take on the trip and if they couldn't express it to to the point where it will be here overnight which you know if you know you know she and stuff take like two weeks to get here even if you do express then it was no point really you know so yeah i just requested a refund so now i'm like okay what am i gonna do with my glasses like i had this whole look in my head and now it's just nothing right so i went in my stash of swimwear and i pulled out this bikini that i've had for years so if y'all could just see y'all just look who titty going in there like even pre-baby even pre-baby y'all i'm surprised that mine was fitting in there because i ain't never been flat chested but i feel like i'm gonna bring that just in case because to get this look off like the look is in my head so i have to get it off 
So I feel like I'm gonna bring that swimsuit just in case, y'all. And when y'all see that picture, those pictures on the ground, like just know that I finessed that look, y'all, because yeah. Who titty? I mean, granted, I just tried it on and it wasn't terrible. Like it wasn't terrible. Um, so I feel like I can make it work, but it's just the fact that I had two swimsuits, two swimsuits that were supposed to be here right now in my suitcase. And it's like, no, no. So I had to go in the sash for that look. Luckily, all my other swimsuits were here on time and I didn't have an issue with that, but yeah, yeah, I just had to bend for a second because that was really stressing me out. And then, y'all know what else is stressing me out? I'm trying to see, well, it's not really stressing me out, but I've been, for the past few days, almost like a week now, I've been taking this detox tea, you know, because we are going on vacation, so we want to look right. We want to look good. So I've been taking this detox to y'all. And at first, I didn't feel like it was working because I wasn't really going to the bathroom. Like, I should, like, I was just going to the bathroom. Oh, focus. I was just going to the bathroom regular, you know. And I thought with detox tea, it was supposed to, like, flush you out, clean you out. So then... Nisha um, told me to put two tea bags in the tea. And so I did it for the first time last night, y'all. And I've been having to get on the toilet all day today. Which is a good thing because we're trying to get flushed out and cleaned out. So my dilemma is, this is the tea, by the way. This is a tea, total tea detox tea. And I got this from Amazon. It was like $17 for this pack. But my dilemma is, should I take it tonight? But we have an early flight in the morning. So I don't want to be running through the airport having the runs. And... It is 10 o'clock right now. It's 10 o'clock. So I don't know, but it really did me right because I could just tell the difference like in the gut area. Like I feel like it eliminated the bloating. Like it did me right. So I feel like if I take it for one more day, I'll be good, but I'm just scared because I don't want to be having to use the bathroom on the plane. Like, I've never used the restroom on the plane before. So, yeah. I don't know, you guys. But what I'm about to do now is... Go take a shower. I need to shave because I was unable to get a wax like I planned. So, I need to clean up down there. <laughs> and, yeah, y'all. So, I am actually going to end the vlog right here. I'm, yeah, I'm going to actually end the vlog right here because... New vlog is coming, travel vlog, of course. Tomorrow we will be in Cancun, Mexico. So y'all stay tuned for that vlog. You guys don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you tomorrow in the Cancun vlog.